The first graders were out playing at recess at Riverview Elementary. It was like any other day, but for one family, it quickly turned into a nightmare. He is just a beautiful, friendly, um, rambunctious, affectionate little boy. The words of an aunt describing her nephew. Alex Hook is this playful six-year-old on the left. Smile. Smile. <laughs> his bright smile is a light in his family's world. He's just a wonderful, wonderful, innocent little six-year-old. Alex lost his innocence on the playground Friday afternoon when a nearby lawnmower picked up a piece of rebar metal with a trajectory aimed right at him. My sister proceeded to where he was and found her son lying on his back with blood coming out of his head and he was not conscious but he was having basically seizures. Flight for Life took Alex from Silver Lake to Children's Wisconsin in Milwaukee. He was rushed into brain surgery where a piece of his skull was removed from a lodged position in his brain. He's now in a medically induced coma for the next 72 hours. It's a waiting game sadly and you know 72 hours may not seem like a lot but it's a lifetime when you're sitting and watching your my nephew, my sister's son, you know, sitting there with tubes coming out of, you know, every orifice on his body. I mean, it's just horrific. The family started a GoFundMe to help with Alex's road to recovery. We don't want to jump ahead of ourselves, but we're trying to be as positive as possible and just know that he's going to come out of this. At this point, we don't know, but that's what we pray for. In Silver Lake, Courtney Sisk, WISN 12 News. 12 News has reached out to the Kenosha County Sheriff's Department for an update on their investigation. So far, we have not heard back. The family's GoFundMe is linked to this story on our website, WISN.com.